Joe, it's just been confirmed that Owen Redden is going to retire after this game. You've worked a lot with him. Could you maybe speak a little bit about Owen and the contribution he's made to Leicester Ireland? What's everyone to play? Yeah, I've, I've, I've really enjoyed working with uh, Owen for the last six years. He's been a part of the, the leadership group um, through those six years, either in Leinster or, or in the Irish setup. Uh, he brings uh, a really a real intelligence to the game um, and a real competitive edge as well. I think his ability to uh, to get the basics dead right have, have allowed him to be incredibly efficient as a scrum half and that's what you want when you're in a pivotal position like that. Um, and also as I said his, his intelligence around the game, his ability to be uh, driving the forwards, respected by the forwards um, it has been really beneficial. So, uh, yeah, it's it, it's something that you know the teams around them have benefited from for, for the six years that I've been involved with them, and obviously prior to that, where he had real success with uh, with Wasps um, and, and with Ireland before I was involved. Okay, you've been done for a long time. What did he bring to the team that you played? Yeah, as, as Joe already said, there he's really competitive man. He's um, he had a phenomenal work rate, you know, he was he was always pushing out others um, to get to the standards that, that he he played played in and you know and times when he when he came on and came off the bench, you know, you could see the, the intensity gone up and that's what he brings. He he just gives it everything and you can see times where he's 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 sucking diesel and well, he's so experienced, and Joe said, even when he's sucking diesel, he can, he can uh, get the basics done really well and and get a backline going. Yeah, um, yeah, I found out about two weeks ago. Uh, Owen told me, and very shocked to be honest. Um, said it to people before. I feel like he's. I said it to him. I thought I feel like he still has a lot left in him, but obviously, got to respect his decision. Um, it's disappointing as as a friend and. As a colleague for a number of years, of serious amounts of respect for him, you've just got to look at his CV and everything that he's achieved in the game. And he's he really has been one of Ireland's um, standout scrum halves uh, through the years. And um, it'd be disappointing not to have him in the changing room uh, with Ireland and Leinster uh, from now on. But be looking forward to catching up with him uh, in his retirement.